Hi everybody, Violet Phoenix here. I just wanted to give you a little update. So the Patchology eye patches that I had mentioned, I'm on my last set of them. And as I've mentioned before, I'm really not thrilled with the packaging. It's a bit challenging to pull apart and, and get on rather messy and, and such. But I will say this, something I really have liked about it is the size. So they really do have a lot of coverage when it comes to the under eye area. So I do like that a lot about that. So that is one thing I, I'm enjoying about this product. I'm unfortunately not seeing a huge difference in something that it could be possibly providing my skin that is different than my favorite eye patches that I have yet to show but I just wanted to let everyone see that this is my final pack I've used all of them and I had purchased them through Ulta something I also wanted to let you all know about is I have this night cream by it that I had received and I wanted to give you feedback on that. It's called confidence in your beauty's sleep for all skin types and then it says Skin Transforming Pillow Cream. Okay, here's the thing about this. With all due respect, because I do have other IT items, or items from IT, it smells atrocious. So, thankfully it's a little bottle, a little trial bottle that I have, and I'm didn't pay for the whole huge uh, package, but I just wanted to warn anyone, if you're wanting to try something out and you care about the smell, I mean, it smells like I'm putting like medicine on my face. Let me try to think of what it really smells like just to be descriptive. It's an odor. I'm trying to put my finger on it, but there's, it's just there's there's a type of medicine medicine kind of smell to it. I'm really good with odors and scents and such. And it was on the tip of my tongue when I first started speaking about it and now I'm a little distracted cuz I'm trying to make sure I get it everywhere. I'll think of it and I'll tell you once I'm done with the container to be a bit more accurate, but let's just put it this way. It's unpleasant. So I'm not sure about it being a beauty pillow or creating a pillow in my skin, but I've put it on. This is the second night I've used it, but it, it really does not smell good. I, I hope perhaps they'll adjust the scent and I'll let everybody know if somehow I become impressed with this. Another item that I had wanted to let everyone know about is... I moved it. Bear with me. I must have gotten knocked down. Let me try to see just one second. One second. Well, I'm not sure where it went, but basically it's this little, I think it's this flower on the box and it's a lip mask. I'll have to find it to be able to use it because I actually really need it right now. And I don't know, it must've fallen off my nightstand. But the point is it's an interesting face mask that I had, a uh, lip mask that I had received to try out and I'm still testing it but I have to say it's been really unique and I'm probably going to recommend it 
So if you need a lip mask for at night, you can do that. I have one by Victoria's Secret that I know is in my nightstand that is a outstanding one. It's super thick and it absolutely stays on your lips all night long. So I definitely recommend that one. I'll show you at some point. But anyway, this is the last night of these. I'll let you know if I'm impressed or not. I really do like how much coverage. So that's a, a great aspect of these. And I think there was something else. Yeah, the main thing is I wanted you to be able to know about that night cream. Mm-mm, not, not doing it for me. And I hope you all have a great evening. I hope these little bits of information help you and save you money. And I can't wait to show you the eye patches that I actually love the best. So have a great night, sweet dreams, and don't forget we are all magic.